Either you rise or you fall. Lewis, how's it going, my friend? Been a while. Thought I'd call, wake you up. I know you're a sleeping fucking giant, but it's time to wake up. Wake up. There's somebody here that wants to see you. Have fun. Lewis of Evolution of Pro Wrestling. Baba Yaga. The Sleeping Giant. The Destroyer. At last our paths have crossed. The time is now. For the Walker. To destroy. Evolution. You like to call me names. You like to call me a clown. Am I funny now? Am I funny to you? You want to call me a clown? You want to call me all these names? But in reality, you are the fucking joke. I am the walker. And you're a disgrace. To this whole competition. You see you're even. Giving up. On the whole competition. You already made your post. Saying that you're done. After the climax. No more competitions for you. I'm not giving up. I'm not going no damn way. If you're giving up. Why the fuck are you still here? Run back to evolution of pro wrestling. Run back to your so-called podcast. A show that's a fucking joke. You don't stand a chance in that world. When you have people like Daz. People like Mike. People like The Butcher. You don't stand a chance against them in the podcasting world your content if that's what you like to call it is stale it's boring it puts people to sleep the facts that you put out on your show are false it's not good and it's a joke But you have fun wasting your time and everyone else's. Your interviews? What the fuck? It's lame. No one knows who the fuck they are. Nobody cares who the fuck they are. No one cares who the fuck you are. But I will do this. You need another opponent. I will be your opponent. Challenge me again and I'll whoop your fucking sorry ass again. Well, that just happened. Oh well. Remember, fuck evolution. You suck. And all hell the real kingpin. Fuck you, Lewis. Have a nice day. Bye. Travis the Walker Anderson. You call me the enemy? You even wished annihilation against Chris because he stood by my side. You all but pulled the trigger on him. You say he was a joke and didn't deserve to be here. And yet, that match was very close. I believe your words were, 
there's no room for weakness. Let me tell you where your weakness was. Letting your guard down. You encourage everyone to vote for Moses. And maybe you didn't expect him to win. You probably even gave yourself a pat on the back when he won the match. He was undefeated until I came along. I threw Moses out the fucking box. And the same thing is going to happen to you. See, I will not encourage the people. They will choose who is the best. I will not stand here and bash you as you've done to the others in this competition. But I will show you the meaning of respect. And when I'm done with you, you will be just another victim, courtesy of the destroyer. <laughs> Either you rise or you fall